Hello everyone, this is Monochrome here and I want to showcase this program that I, I don't think many people have heard or maybe people have heard and I am just one of the small amount of people who have not heard of it. It's called PNG Phone or Ping Phone depending upon how you want to call it. Ping as in PNG, the format is called Ping instead of PNG. That's how it is according to Wikipedia and stuff. So choose whatever you want. Uh, PNG Phone is what I will call it. It is basically a program that can provide you with an image of the face of the moon uh, as a bitmap image, which looks pretty cool. And you could set up as a wallpaper or something like that. Uh, there's a small history before we showcase what that is because it's uh, it's one simple pro program. So so I'm gonna show you something called Foon. Uh, which is how everything started. So, Foon uh, shows the face of the moon, and it is an ASCII image, as you can see in this in this website. Or I could show you that on my screen on my system. That's how it is. It's pretty simple. And then someone made a not really someone. I know I don't know the I, I know the name, but I don't want to pronounce the name. So I'm just gonna call it someone. Uh, this other person or groups of people. I think there are two made a. Uh, made a version of Foon called Xfoon. That's like even linked below. Xfoon sets the X root window to be to a picture of the moon in its current phase, including the partial lighting of the dark side by a reflected Earth light. Sounds fancy. That's basically this image. Uh, and it sets that image as the root window background for X11. But I don't use X11. I use Sway. You might be able to see this, but it kind of is a bit small. Yeah, that should be enough, I suppose. So Sway is a Wayland compositing window manager, and uh, I am sure people want to he uh, hear me say Sway as a compositor, but it's a fucking window manager. So I'm just gonna call it a window manager that also can be. Com uh, that was that uh, that does compositing as well. So it's a compositing window manager, and I fight to death if someone says it's a compositor and not a window manager, because that's 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 how it is, you know. So Sway is a window manager. Anyway, uh, Xfoon will not work on most desktop environments, even if you 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 are using X11. It will only work on like minimal window managers like Haskell and I and not Haskell. What was it called? Xmonad. Yeah, it's written in Haskell. Xmonad, DWM, and uh, and the rest. Maybe even Qtile. I, I don't know. On window managers, you might able to might be able to see that, but on a desktop environment or on Wayland, if you are using Wayland, uh, you might not see. So <clears throat> that's how this other program was made. It's called PNG Phone. It's an alternative to the X11 version of X Phone, you know. So the re reasoning was somewhere here. I forgot where it is. Yeah, like this is a reasoning. Ho the whole shebang, I guess. Yeah, the image is pronounced as ping, not PNG. That is also written here. I would not have noticed. Um, sorry. If it wasn't for that. <clears throat> uh, the thing is that you you don't really see the x elements root window if you're using a desktop environment and so I, I probably have said that before so what does png phone does it's pretty simple both x phone and png phone are available on the debian repository so you can just install it like that i could do a sudo app install x phone i think i used one more and it will install yep maybe the it, it just ins I, I don't know it, it doesn't matter i don't want it actually what i want is <coughs> png phone that can be installed with app install png phone i already have it installed so what does it do This is the whole shebang. This is all the flags that you could <coughs> possibly use with it. Some of them are mandatory. Some of them aren't. It's pretty simple. Uh, 
uh, you do png phone then hyphen width and height mm. those are your width and height of your screen that is your screen resolution and then there is star density which is the amount of stars you're gonna see and then hyphen f for a file name so i'm gonna show that hyphen w is if you use a 1920 by 1080p screen if you're not sure just open up neo fetch will show you that no resolution should be there i am using a pretty old thinkpad an x220 which is i think 11 years old and it has a 768p screen so i'm gonna do w e is thir what was it again 1366 1366 and then height will be 768 and then hyphen f is the file name i'm just gonna give it moon 768p dot png then hyphen s is for the stars i like 100 because that gives me like a nice amount of stars that is not too much and you hit enter and you see it's on your home screen yeah that file is on your computer right now here's another way of seeing it <coughs> uh, so what you're gonna do is use whatever wallpaper setting program that you use to set that wallpaper it's pretty simple i have a, a script that sets that wallpaper up it sets that and you'll be able to see it like this that's pretty much the whole program nothing special it's not that complicated uh, one thing you could do is you could if you don't use something uh, like uh, what is it fair or whatever that you use to set a wallpaper and you use your, use your own script that use some sort of program then it's easier to just add ping phone as a feature in your own script like uh, since i am on sway i use sway sway bg as the program that sets the wallpaper that's the wallpaper setting program for sway but instead of just using sway bg i use a script that i wrote myself called set bg so set background and then i can give it a lot of stuff and i can show that script if you want to set bg this is the whole shebang that's pretty much the whole script it's what 38 lines of code that too is just functions if you want to remove the function then it's easier so i don't think terminus goes ah yeah it does go bigger bigger so for me all i do is set bg hyphen x you know as an x phone and i hit enter and it sets that as wallpaper and hyphen s will shuffle and shuffle again might be able to see that yep <coughs> and then what else did i have i can also like set the wallpaper as a image just set bg and then like pictures and wallpaper just give it a number and it will set that as a wallpaper as well let's give it another wallpaper hmm wall haven that could be something okay we got some initial d wallpapers here so that's my script as well you can find that script and uh, other stuff that i wrote which isn't much but you know i'm not a programmer i can barely code but if you want something like that you should check up my git repo uh i can show you that um just check out codeberg.org slash monochrome and uh, just click scripts That is, I I think I've done a decent job at documentation. Just go to set BG, and you will be able to see what you can do with it. And all you need to do is just download this bit. You know, just click download here and copy it somewhere else on your system, and make sure to have 
like the dependencies met which is sway bg and ping phone ping phone you don't really need it unless you are trying to use the hyphen x flag to set the moon but if you just want to set your wallpapers like normal then hyphen s you know i mean sway bg is the only thing you need also check out my website if you want a more textual version of this which is monochrome.codeberg.page just go to the uh, blog or on the bottom it has that you click on that and then you get a more textual version of it it's slightly smaller <laughs> because i don't rant but yeah that's the whole video okay that's basically it i'll see you guys on another video peace